Hey guys, today I've got something very interesting to talk about. You can get any item you want in Animal Crossing using this method. This is a Nukazon. It's basically like a kind of Animal Crossing Amazon kind of shopping center for all of your Animal Crossing New Horizon needs. Basically, it has a Discord server hookup where if you join this website here and you link your Discord account, you can basically go shopping. Like you basically find a person who lists an item. For example, let's go clothing. Let's go have a look at clothing here. You can find by different accessories, bags, bottoms, dresses, headwear, anything in particular. You can search through the lists, anything that you want to want to get. For me, for example, I wanted to get a samurai helmet. Right, so we got the samurai items here, the wig, the shirt, the helmet, and the greaves. I didn't even know they had greaves. And the wig, to be honest. I thought we thought it was the shirt and the helmet. So we're going to go to the helmet here, and you can see what colors the item actually comes in. You can click them for a quick little preview over there for what you're basically looking for. I want this black one over here, and I'm going to go search down this list here looking for the black one. You can see there's a person here selling the black one. All they want in trade for it is the Samurai Greaves. You can see, for example, some other people have different prices here. This person wants 90,000 bells for this helmet over here. And this person wants uh, an offer. You basically make an offer. You can click this person's name over here and it will open Discord up in a new tab and it'll basically be in a messaging mode. You can press the little three dots here, message, and you'll be able to message this person directly asking them, you know, hey, do you still have this item available? And I've actually already done this trade uh, with someone else, Oreo Fox, and we traded the Black Samurai Helmet already, which I actually have in my island right now. That is actually pretty cool. I just need to get the torso, the little, <laughs> the boots, and the wig, maybe. I don't know about the wig. The wig feels kind of weird. I, I, I feel like I don't need the wig, but we'll get to that. So after messaging someone, you can either, like, figure out, uh, like, what offer you want to make, or if they have, like, a standalone offer, like... Like, like the one person said 90,000 bells. This person here said they can do it for 15,000 bells or if I have any of the items on their wish list. Now, wish lists are very interesting. You can see this is the wish list from the person that sent it to me. You can make your own wish list through your account section on the website over here, Nukazon. And, you know, any item that this person wants, you can go look here. I actually had the rice cooker that I got recently today. So what I did is I traded my rice cooker for a samurai helmet, which was pretty Easy and efficient. The person was very, they had like a cool, like nice little section you can see on screen here. We just dropped our items. We swapped over, picked our items up and it was all good. Nothing went wrong. There are some people who are m maybe taking like advantage of this, but there is a way to stop it. Once a person like runs in your island and you know, like if you give them something and they, they, don't, they don't like give you something in return, usually whoever's buying should pay first. If you do find yourself in a situation where the other person is not kind of handing up their end of the trade and, you know, you're worried that you're about to get scammed, the best thing to do is either just close your game immediately because it will act as if this island thing has never even happened. So you won't be losing your item and the person who you just traded to won't be getting that item either. It will basically reset you guys each so that you don't get scammed and they don't get scammed either if they're worried about you scamming them. So it's kind of like a quick way to prevent scams. You can also change your system to air airline mode, airplane mode, <laughs> so that it kind of loses internet access, which does the same thing. But yeah, it's all, it's all up to you. The real nice thing about this is that you can get clothing, you can get furniture, you can get DIY recipes, flowers, fossils, fruits, furniture, materials, posters, songs, tools, and even villagers. You can actually trade villagers, which is very interesting. It's It's got a process that's explained on the website. I'm not going to go into too much detail on that, but I'm like more focusing on the part of trading items, which is fantastic. I suggest you actually have a trading section on your island right at your airplane. So what you want to do is create a like a blockage so that the person cannot just run into your island because you obviously don't want this person running into your island, breaking your trees, losing your, your flowers, just, you know, just breaking stuff. But they cannot pick up any objects and they cannot move any objects. What I did is basically put a table alongside some fences that I have right at the entrance by the airport so that the person who's on the other side cannot get into my island at any way, but we can at least drop items onto the table in a trade. So I can drop down the item that the person is trading for and they can give me the money for it, vice versa. But obviously the whoever is buying, whoever is traveling to the island or buying or initiated the thing should be the person who pays first. That's always how it works. If you're trading for something, you should always give the item first. That's just how 
you know all these situations go. If you are worried, like I mentioned, just close your game or turn off your internet access immediately so that none of it actually happens. Like you'll get your item back. You'll basically go back to your island as if the trade never happened. Actually, it's like you never even went on the plane. <laughs> it's also a good practice to, after a trade, go to the person's account and leave them a nice little review about the the trade. Were you unhappy? Did they scam you? Was they taking too long? Were they freaking you out? I don't know. Like, was it fast? I actually had a very fast trade and I'm very happy with my new samurai helmet. I'm going to work on getting the others, <laughs> the other pieces of the samurai set. And yeah, it was, it was a great, kind of like way to go about a thing the wish list is amazing so you can kind of see who's looking for kind of what you can offer a trade whether you even want to trade them some nook mile tickets or even some bells sometimes they might just want an item in trade like how i did mine with the rice cooker for the samurai helmet which is kind of a bargain for me i think but yeah so Oreo Fox, thank you for the trade. I really appreciate you letting me do this video and like let everyone know how this Nookazon system works. I think it's really fantastic and it's a great way to get things that you really, really, really want. I know a lot of you guys are trying to get that that ironwood furniture. This is a really good way to get it. Like seriously, it's a really, really good way to get the ironwood furniture in this game. Is to literally just go in here, type ironwood like this. I believe it's ironwood, just one word. Let's search for that. The ironwood furniture, here it is, all of it. Let's say the cupboards over here, and you'll be able to find out who is selling for it, or even who is looking for it. So if you have one and you're willing to sell it, you can go looking for it, and these people here are looking for it, and they're willing to buy it for 20000 This one will make an offer for it. You know, you can, you can kind of sell things to people using this method as well. So it's a really cool site to sell and buy items across Animal Crossing. I think it's fantastic. It's, it's truly amazing. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this was new information that you're able to utilize and buy things in the game. It's really fantastic and I'm happy to share it with you today. So I'll see you guys in a future Animal Crossing video. Thank you for watching. See you guys later.